a significant other? Uh, I've been married for three and a half years. We're happily married. At the moment, I don't have a significant other. I'm married. I'm in a relationship with me. Yes, I do have a significant other. I have a significant other. We've been together 16 years. I have a cat. My fiance is in the industry as well. We met before I started doing porn. Um, and they do porn also. We're both polyamorous. He was my high school sweetheart. And he's sitting behind the camera right now. He met me when I was doing porn. I did now corrupt him, so he is now a performer as well. We have always had a fun-loving, open-ish relationship. The first time we had sex, was a three-way with his girl roommate. Is, is it hard to be in a relationship while being a porn actress? It makes it more difficult than if you were not. Of course. It makes it so much more difficult to be in a relationship. Porn's a bitch to have relationships in. When your significant other is in this same industry, then it makes things a lot easier. Anyone that I've dated uh, has been okay with me doing porn. I would never be in a relationship with somebody who had a problem with my work. We recently broke up, but he was actually really good with my job. He just didn't think about it at all. It was never an issue. I've uh, been in a few relationships, and usually porn hasn't been an issue because I tend to go after guys who are mature and they know the difference between sex and intimacy. Sex and love are two very different things. You know, I go to set, I, I have the sex, you know, it's acting, it's theatrical theater. And then the second the camera stops rolling, I'm myself again, put my sweatpants on, go home and do the dishes. It's just like any other job and it takes a very mature person, lots of trust and respect to make it work. If they're not okay with a specific type of porn that I'm doing or who I'm working with that day, I tell them to suck it. It just, I mean, it's kind of no big deal. I, like I said, I'm not doing boy-girl scenes, and it's not like he's doing boy-girl scenes either. So if someone wants to hire me for a boy-girl scene, then we do it together. People aren't used to dating somebody who has sex with a lot of other people, but that's why most people date inside the porn industry. It's just easier that way. Never works out, but it's easier that way. <laughs> Porn for me has been liberating. I've spent, I, since I was a teenager, like in middle school, I haven't been able to live my life without a boyfriend or a girlfriend or another half. And I just always need that sexual energy constantly. I like. Porn helped me get out of that. It's very difficult to find someone who um, is okay with something like that. And if they are, sometimes they then become not okay with it. And then you found yourself in a relationship um, and in love with somebody and, and they can't handle it anymore all of a sudden. Or, um, which is fine if that's how you feel, that's fine. But it's very difficult to find someone like that. And then you also get the people who like just want to date you because you are a porn star and they don't like actually care about you as a human being. Like there's different levels to it. It's very difficult. I think that's why a lot of porn people date within their community. He does perform and it makes it a hundred times easier dating another performer because the jealousy issues just don't exist. He understands that when I go on set, I'm just, I'm going there to have my fun and get my paycheck and go home. He gets to work with girls. He gets to have fun, he gets that outlet, gets paid, and and that's it. And otherwise, you know, we get to spend the time together watching our favorite shows and cooking dinner and going out and all that special stuff that is so much more important than sex. It's a job at the end of the day. There's no emotional attachment to anyone. At the beginning, you know, he was like, okay, it's a job and I have to accept it because I love you for who you are. They love my porn. In fact, they watch it sometimes and they send me and keep messages about how hot it was. He won't watch the scenes, I don't think but he loves to hear about him. My ex always watched my scenes and that's what made him a better person in bed. <laughs> Do you think that, let's say, God forbid, your uh, fiance got struck down by, um, I don't know, Jesus? You could ever date a civilian? I would, but I would cheat. So I feel like with if, if I were to date somebody not in porn, it would be more likely that they would be not okay with me enjoying my job and and having fun sexually like that. Whereas a person who's in the industry, I can come home and say, oh my God, I had a great scene, and they're not gonna be jealous and weird about it. They're gonna be like, oh honey, I'm so happy you had a good day at work. Like for me to like date a civilian, 
it's most likely not gonna happen. I have in the past, and as hard as I've tried and realized, you know, this is what I want, it's really not, and it's just hard. That's disgustingly functional. It's gross. I should be ashamed of myself. But it's true!